Yo, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? It's your host with the most, your favorite podcast host and game show host, Ron P. I'm in the building with a special guest. It's long overdue. Uh, y'all give it up one. Y'all give it up one time for the Killer Queen. What's up? What's up? How you doing? I'm doing really good. How the world treating you? It's been treating me pretty good too. How you've been treating the world? Really good. That's what's you up. You get what you get, right? In return. That's what I'm saying. Um, before this video start, make sure y'all subscribe to the channel and make sure y'all go over to flavorandfire.com. Go over there, buy up a bunch of stuff. Tell them Ron P sent you. Use my discount code Ron P15 and get 15% off of your order. Those are my people over there. You like uh spicy food? I do. I'm gonna have to get you some when you uh uh, I, I work with a hot sauce company. They make salsas, hot sauce, rubs, spicy, Ooh. spicy, like the spiciest uh, hot sauces and stuff. So I'm gonna, to, I'm gonna have to, I'm have to get you right. I'm gonna have to get you right. For sure, that sounds good. So what we're about to do right now is we gonna we we finna test you on some things. We finna test you on some trivia. Are you ready to do some trivia? Let's get it. All right. Ron P. TV trivia. And I'm going to see how good you are at this trivia. You have to get at least five of these questions right. All right. For everyone you get wrong, you do have to take a shot. Her drink is Hennessy today, ladies and gentlemen. Um, she brought her boyfriend with her. Her boyfriend, Quota. He over there. Say what's up to the people. What's going on, y'all? Yep, that's him. He will be her lifeline if she needs help on any of these. Um... The goal is not to get drunk. <laughs> right? <laughs> All right. So I am going to mute your microphone until she needs you. And are you ready? Let's get it. All right. So the first question. What is the address that Dory had to remember in the movie Finding Nemo? Is it A, B, C, or D? A. You sure? Hey. Let's see. Okay. Go to the second one. What year was McDonald's founded? A, B, C, or D? Shit. I'm going to go with... Uh, I'm going to go with B. B? Final answer? Yeah, final answer. Wrong. So, she has to take a shot for that. So, go ahead, queen. Do your thing. Cheers, y'all. That's all right. That's all right. You can redeem yourself. Are you ready for the next question? Yes. What city did the sitcom Family Matters take place in? New York, Los Angeles, Chicago, or Denver? First of all, you remember Family Matters. I do, but I haven't, like, it's not something that I watch on the daily type. But I'm going to have to say C. C. Final answer? Yeah. Okay. Let's go. Which U.S. president birthday is February 22nd? Is it Abraham Lincoln, George Washington, Bill Clinton, or George W. Bush? I'm going to have to go with, um... <laughs> and you know what? what's funny about these questions? Hold on. I randomly thought of these. Yeah? Yeah. That's, these are all me making, making, <laughs> making these... Making shit up. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I thought... <laughs> these are some good questions, though. These really are some good questions, because 
this shit really got me thinking, like, why I didn't pay attention in school, you know? Yeah, I don't even think they taught this in yeah, school. Yeah, they probably didn't. They just yeah, taught yeah. us, like, what order the presidents came in. Yeah. That's about it. It's my random ass. All right. So let me get number A. Number A. Which is letter A. Number A, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Number so A, a. Abraham. Abraham Lincoln. Final answer? Nah, letter A. Oh, letter A. Okay. Mm. So close yet so far. Shot it up. And the goal was to not get drunk. Not get drunk. Cheers. Cheers. That's right. You feeling good? You good? I'm great. All right. That's what's up. We're going to ask you a couple more and see how you do. Which movie did Denzel Washington receive his first Oscar for? A, B, C, or D. And don't forget, you have lifelines. Okay. Which movie did Denzel Washington receive his first Oscar for? Man on Fire, Training Day, Glory, or Malcolm X? I want to say... I really want to say... I feel like I need to go with D. D? D is in dog? Ooh, she don't sound sure. No. It's like I'm I'm com- I'm conflicted between two. You got your lifeline over there. All right, yeah. Let's you want to use your talk. lifeline? Yeah, I'll use my. All life. right, all right. So, lifeline, <clears throat> lifeline. Hello, how over are here you? Bleeding. I popped a pimple. Oh, <laughs> are you good? Yeah. I'm just like Wanda on Martin. I, I got you. What you what whatever you, you need, need, I got whatever you. Whatever you need, I got you. Um, well, while he's tending to his wounds over there, the girl need help. So All right. The question is, which movie did Denzel Washington receive his first Oscar? Was it A, Man on Fire, B, Training Day, C, Glory, or D, Malcolm X? All right, I'm not even going to lie. I'm not 100% sure. But as far as the reason, I have a feeling it's, can I say it right? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's Glory, because I know that's one of his early movies. Okay, so he says it's Glory. It's up to you if you take that answer and run with it or or what. So what do you, do you want to take his, his, his suggestion? See, like, I feel like that's a good suggestion. Which, I'm but sorry. just because it was his first Oscar doesn't mean it was from his first movie. Yep. So what? it's like, eh. and I never, to be honest, the only movie I've seen on here is Training Day. What? That. <laughs> it's like I hear everybody talk about Malcolm X, but I've never watched it. Like I've only watched Training Day, to be honest. Okay, well, you got homework to do. Yep. I got a lot of homework to do because I was on my second shot already. That would though. actually be my second option to be Training honest. Training day. Yeah, that was my first option to be honest. So, But Malcolm X is something that was really, really huge. So it's like... <sighs> All right, one, two, three, go boom. I'm going to go with D. D, Malcolm X. Who you were right. It was glory. Right. See, you just got to listen. I should have listened see? to the lifeline. Yep, see. They be thick. Now I got to take a shot because I didn't listen to my lifeline. Now you got to right. take two. What? <laughs> oh, you going to take the shot? No, he was right. He was right. So, see, they don't be listening. Women don't listen to men. They be thinking we don't be knowing. They're right. Yep. Yeah, I... <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I got to take it. Take it. One, two, three, go boom. Cheers. Yeah. Savor the flavor. How you feeling? Like I just drank a whole bunch of penny water. Oh, okay. Is that what Hennessy tastes like? Slick, yeah, but it's just something about it. It's like I'm a... I'm a tea kind of guy. That's why I have my 
teacup that I be Okay, Romkey you know. TV cup. Oh yeah. I need, me, I need me one of those. You will get I one like of those tea. because everybody who come on the show leave with a pardon <gasps> gift. You will get one. That's dope. I love yeah. that. All right, I'm gonna ask you this last question. Are you ready? Let's get it. The question is sex can be I'm sorry, sex can cause temporary memory loss. Is that true or false? True, because that happens to me. Okay. <laughs> Final answer, you sounded sure. Final answer. Hey, there you go. So you you didn't do horrible, but you didn't do good. But that's all right. We have other segments that you can make this up with. All right? All right. All right, so we will be back, and y'all stay tuned. So we are back, having a great time with the queen. How you? Uh, how you feeling, queen? I'm feeling. I'm feeling a little warm. <laughs> a little warm. I wonder why. It's a little warm, you know. It's the shots, but it's the shots. It's the shots. So what we gonna do right now is. Run, 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 you got mail. You've got mail. You've got mail. I fuck with that. Yeah. Yeah. This is the segment of the show where, Queen, you've got mail. Ooh, I got mail. You got got some mail mail right here. mail. Yeah. So, you have two envelopes. Let me explain what you're doing. Mm Mm-hmm. And one of these envelopes is cash. Okay. And then the other, other, I said other, and the The other envelope is shots. Like shots, like. Alcohol, alcohol shots. Alcohol oh, shots. Shots. Now, whichever one you pick, that's which one you got to do. Are you ready? Let's get it. All right, she, she ready. All right, queen. Which one of these envelopes do you want? Any, mini, money, mo. Catch a motherfucker by his toe. A motherfucker, bro. If you holler, let him go. Any, mini, money, mo. Take that one. This one. All right. Let's see what's in there. Ooh, oh, she won a few dollars. Okay. Want some money? Now, Queen, we have this thing that we call we call return to sender. You could give me that back with a chance at winning more cash. Or winning more shots. Or you could just walk away with your few bucks. What you want to do? I'm not a gambler, so I'm going to take my money and run. She's going to take her money and run. Now, is it a gamble or ain't life about taking chances? What did Miss Frizzle tell us? Miss Frizzle said, take chances. Make mistakes and get messy. That's what the fridge said. She but did. but she did. if you want to walk away with your few bucks, that's fine by me. I, I just see the, the I see the I see the the doubt in your eye. I do got a little doubt. All right. Give you some if, thinking music. If I if I I mean that's and Miss Frizzle or OG. Real OG. She a real OG. She was a step on that bus. Like, she knew what the fuck she was talking about. The frizz. I can't let Miss Frizz down. You, you doing it for the frizz? I'm doing it for the frizz. She doing it for the frizz. I'm doing it for the frizz. She returned in the sender. Returning to sender. I can't let Miss Frizz down, y'all. <laughs> if I did, like, what would I be? Uh... Can't let her down. She got more mail, ladies and gentlemen. She got mail. I've got Ron P. TV mail. Yes, you do. And then one of these envelopes is more cash or shots. it may be more shots. Hmm. Right, the any, mini, mini, more motherfucker yeah, again. I think so. All right. Hold on. Any, mini, mini, mo. Catch a motherfucker by his toe. If he holler, let him go. Any, mini, money, mo. Let me get this one. This one. Let me get this one. All right. I'm scared. Oh, uh, my chest hot. I'm scared for. Oh, I 
I got she cash, y'all. Cash. I got cash, y'all. She got cash. Mm, I got cash. Cash. That's what I'm I got about. more cash than I had before. Just and so y'all know. That's what y'all was That's wondering. what we do at Ron PTV. That's what that, we do at Ron PTV. We get more cash. That's what it's all about. That's what it's about. Now. I shouldn't take this from you. No, this is my souvenir. I need this That's your from souvenir. Rocky TV. I need you to sign this and everything. I got you. Yeah, I need this signature and everything. But what if I told you there's a chance for you to win even more cash than that if you return to sender? Or you could walk away with what you have. It's totally up to you. You are dealing with the... Ron, Ron, Ron P. You've got mail. You've got mail. You, you've got mail. It's your call. I'll give you some thinking music. <laughs> the concentration is real. You know what? If I can't let Miss Frizzle down once, I can't let her down twice, right? You 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 step in like that. Yeah, cuz I mean, if I can't let her down once, I can't let her down twice. She's stepping like that. I can't let her down twice. Come on. I can't. I can't. Now, Queen, it'll be more cash in one of these envelopes or a lot more shots in the other one. Are you ready? Let's get it. Let's get it. Fuck they talking about. Fuck they talking she about. She came to play. I came to play. This one from Miss Frizzle. And if even if I take these shots, they still for Miss Frizzle. So right. Uh, you know. Who taking shots for Miss Frizz like these days? Nobody. Nobody. Nobody but me. You know. I don't think I'm gonna eeny meeny miny mo this one, cause you know. Let me get this one. Breathe, I got mail, y'all. Breathe, queen. I got mail, y'all. I got Ron PTV mail. What's up? <laughs> what we do? What we do? She Ooh, I got money. <laughs> I got money. You did good. Money. I did good. You did good. Because who gets money every time like that? Nobody. The queen. The what? queen. Yeah, the queen. The queen. One more time for the queen. The queen. What? I get money like that. That's what I'm that talking about. That was for Miss Frizzle, y'all. Shouts out to Miss Frizzle. Shout out to Miss Frizzle. Frizzle. Got you through this without having she to take did. a shot. She did. See, that's she did. that's what people got to do. You got to follow your instinct, ladies and gentlemen. You got to follow your gut. Yeah. That's what's up. All right, so we're going to take a commercial break, and we will be right back. Right back. All right, so we are back. She just did her thing, won some cash. Give it up for her one more time. You enjoying yourself? I am. I really am. Good, good. Appreciate that. So now we're about to do another segment. This one is called... Can you spell it? Can you spell it? Can you spell it? How do you spell it? Can 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 you spell it? We're about to do spelling challenge. I fuck with that. I fuck with that. Hard body? Yeah. Yeah, That shit is hard. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Now, I'm going to give you some words to spell, but here is the twist. These are not regular spelling words. These the trap B spelling words or whatever. So these is words that spell the way that they're pronounced mm. so whatever you learned in school did that shit we ain't here for that we here for the trap the way we talk the way i'm gonna need you to spell the word all right you have your lifeline here shouts out to quota yes sir yes sir he in the building all right so that's gonna be your lifeline Okay. For every word that she gets wrong, you gotta take a shot. Are you ready? Let's get it. All right, Queen. The word that you have to spell is spend a night. 
Now I can give you the definition, the origin, or use it in a sentence. So the word is spend a night. Use it in a sentence. Hey Ma, can my friend spend a night? All right. I need a trap definition, actually. Or a trap use it in a sentence, you know? Trap use it in a sentence. Trap use it in a sentence. <laughs> it in a sentence. It don't get no more hood than that, Ma. Right. Can, my, can my cousin spend a night? Spend a night. Spend a night. All right. S P E N N A N I G H T. Final answer. Yeah. The correct spelling is S P E N A N I T E. Spend a night. Oh, like N I T. We. I told you, don't come in here with this. What you learned at school. Right, because N I G H T. Like that's, that's too proper. Like, that's, that's too proper. We, this is the trap spelling bee. Spend a night. Let me get it together, y'all. It's spend a night. Spend a night. Spend a night. Go ahead and enjoy that shot. So now you see what we're doing here. Yo, Ron. Ron got me this limited edition Nas Hennessy bottle, y'all. I come through. That's how I come through. Shot. See a shot, take a shot. So if y'all see this right now and y'all got some alcohol, y'all better take a shot. Everybody take a shot. Take a shot for my man Nas. Yeah, shouts out to Nas. That's one of my top five. Oh, shit. You feeling it? I'm feeling some. <laughs> <laughs> shit. Are you ready for your next word? I'm ready. Your word is for shizzle. Like fa or fo? Fa shizzle. Fa shizzle. F A S H I Z Z L E Final answer Final answer I like the the, the anticipation Fuck <laughs> Yeah <laughs> Yep I got one right y'all uh. You gave me a minute to get my chest back together. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let me run through here. Let me run through but here. Just so y'all know, the place of origin is Snoop Dogg. Place of origin is Snoop Dogg. Let's on my nizzle. Let me see what I want to get. I'm, I'm going to try to take it easy on you. Mm. All right. Are you ready? Let's get it. Your word is bando. Place of origin, the trap. All right, so I lived in ATL for a good good part of my life. Oh, you got this then. So I'm going to say it's B-A-N-D-O, Bando. Final. Shout out to Migos, final. Yes. She ain't taking no shots, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to I'm gonna have to fuck your head up, though. Go ahead. I already knew you was on it. I have to. <laughs> Your word, and you might want to use a lifeline, call a friend, uh, call the president, somebody for this one. Your word is what you ma call it. What you ma call it. Say it in a sentence. The police was at what you ma call it, them house down the street again. Damn, it's probably my cousin. Your cousin and um. Shout out to your primo. Fucking around. Fucking around. What the fuck around? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> um. What you gonna call it? Place of origin is somebody with a bad memory. What you gonna call it? You almost gotta snap your fingers when you say like, "What you gonna call it?" Right. Like, what you call that shit? Yeah. It's like, what you gonna call that shit? Do I want to call my lifeline? No, I don't think so. I think I'm going to save that. All right, W. (laughs) (laughs) W. A. T. C. 
H A M A C A L I T Final Your final? I'm debating if it got two L's or one. I'm gonna add that second L. Okay. Which I'm gonna call it? Yeah, second L. Two L's. You know how I can confidently hit this button? Because <laughs> it was already wrong in the beginning. <laughs> it was already wrong in the see. beginning. Oh, it had a fucking H. Yeah. Like watch him call it, but it's really what you No, it's what W H A T. Oh yeah, what what you what you call it? Yep. But it had the two L's. I just was missing the H. That's it. That's bold. As Van Diesel once said, it don't matter if you win by an inch or a mile. Winning is winning. Losing is losing. One letter or not. See, if any, if if at any time to use a lifeline, I think that would have been it. I agree. You agree, bro? I agree. I agree. Nah, I would answer. I would have oh, the same it? way. <laughs> oh, but I, I ain't gonna lie. You would have got the H to. No, nah, I mean you put. You said what you gonna call it? The only thing you saw wrong was the double L. No, I forgot. I ain't gonna lie. For some reason, I thought it was gonna not put a what like a T. I thought it was gonna be what. W A C H. Oh, like watch. He said, "Don't it? think about it like you learned it in school." Right, yeah. You feel right. me? So I'm like W A C H. So Definitely the, the devil. Either L, way. So good thing but. I saved my lifeline, y'all, basically. Okay. We got another word for you. All right, let me take this shot. You're doing great. You're doing great. Are you ready for your next word? Your final word. Let's get it. Let's get it. The word is sandwich. <laughs> I say this shit all the time. <laughs> you said in the center, I'm about to go to the house and eat a sandwich. S A M M I C H. Sandwich. Final. Final sandwich. Let me ask bro, bro, do you think she right? Yeah. 100%. 100%. <laughs> oh well you did good in that second I you only did. had to take what one shot one shot okay yeah that's what's up you're doing your thing Damn. I go, yeah I, I'm she rocking it. i'm getting it um we're going on a commercial break and we will be right back well i appreciate y'all tuning in to this episode make sure y'all follow her on all her social medias they will be in the link below make sure you guys go over to flavorandfire.com flavor and fire y'all yep flavorandfire.com go over there use the discount code ryan p15 get 15 percent off your order all of my information is in the description if you want to be a guest on the show the information just popped up on the screen until next time all right, shout out y'all. Y'all lock in with Ron P T V. M E B C M E B is a cartel. Yes, ma'am. It's a cartel. You coming back though, right? Always. All right. All right. Always. So we out. Until next time. Peace. <laughs>